Doctor, what's out there? What did this to him? Tro... they're called Trodon Pectinodon. They were meant to be euthanized, but... What? You let them out? No, no! I kept them in quarantine, for study. They... I thought they may have been leaving the pen somehow, but I wasn't certain. You knew about those damn creatures all along. While we were out there, exposed, humping around like idiots looking for our pilot... Billy, wait! We were nearly killed by one of our own men. Probably bitten by one of those things, just like Decaf. Who knows where his catatonic body is now? Both our teams are dead. Oscar's dead! All because of your dinosaurs, all because of you! Oscar gave you an order, clear as day. Get these people to safety! Maybe she's not people in my eyes. Anyway, this witch is a liar. She's lied to all of us. Put me in the direct line of danger to protect her agenda and her precious freak show. What else is she hiding? Please, if I knew sooner, oh, I... shut it. Yes, she lied to all of us, but she also helped when she could. Nima is alive because of her. She could have warned us. I wasn't entirely sure yet. For all I knew, she could have gotten into the quarantine pens. Oh, so what? I'm the enemy? I'm the bad guy here? I'm just trying to open your eyes. I'm trying to show you the truth and bring someone to account for it. Injun is the enemy here. They spoiled the island. They made these monsters. You can't make her pay for all that Injun has done. Maybe. Put down the knife. We need to work together, all of us. All she has to say is it's my fault. It's my fault. Come on, Doc. Let me hear it. No, it wasn't. Say it! It's... it's m my fault. There. That wasn't so difficult, was it? My friends would have saved him here. At least I got the truth out of him. You want her alive? You got her. <sighs> just mark my words. She will save just one of those animals before she lifts a finger to help you. Now, everyone make themselves useful. I've got a tend to decay. Look, we can't stay here long. Let's just give Billy a minute and see if we can find anything useful. A way out, even. Okay. We'll do a sweep of the room and check in when we're done. Agreed? I think they're empty. They're still heavy, though. see anything. Maybe it's clear. What about this grate? It looks big enough for everyone. And it looks like it's heading in the right direction. I don't understand. I thought the dinosaurs couldn't breed. They can't. They're all female. Then how do they lay eggs? Theropods shed eggs just like most other ova um, egg-laying animals. Think about chickens. The whole egg market is made up of unfertilized eggs, right? Oh, yeah. So they still have to lay them? Oh, my. What is it? You bring up a good point about our dinosaurs ovulating, but these eggs are gathered in a clutch. This is brooding behavior. So? Chickens will brood a large enough clutch. But not our dinosaurs. I've found post-ovulatory eggs in the ranges. They're mal-shaped, usually destroyed or kicked into the bush. I see. Wait, it, we can't jump to any conclusions. How could this even be possible? Could a girl dino turn into a boy dino? With Dr. Wu's slapdash approach to gene sequencing, anything could go wrong. A flare kit. 
This might come in handy. Nima, what can you remember about that animal that bit you? I didn't see it when it attacked. It went by so fast. It was dark. After it bit me, I became confused, like, like I'd been drugged. I remember there were many of them. They had glowing eyes. Glowing eyes? Yeah, like ojos del lobo. These Trodon, what else can you tell me about them? Well, they're nocturnal. They're intelligent, like raptors, but they don't hunt like them. They envenomate with a single bite, then back off. Stalk their prey. Their teeth are serrated and retain saliva, and the saliva is saturated with the toxin. Nima's bite. It was from a Trodon? Yes. Definitely. Jerry, we should get moving. Yeah, are you ready? This is not the time for grieving. We have to move. Maybe we should... She's right. Did you find something? No, nothing. Is everyone ready? What about decaf? I took care of that. It looked like you took something off him. And if he has something that will help us... I didn't find anything. I took his dog tags. Insurance doesn't pay out to his family unless his dog tags are returned. Satisfied? Right. Sorry for pushing. Should we bring him with us? Why bother? He's already buried. Look, I know where his body is. We're not equipped to transport it. Hopefully, we can retrieve his remains when this is all over. All right, listen up. Everything that just happened, bygones, understand? Doc, tell me again about the phones. Um, according to the terminal in my lab, the marine exhibit phones are still connected to the transceiver. The visitor center phones Too are- Too far away, okay? And we can get to the exhibit through the tunnels? They're all interconnected. I think I can still find- The answer is yes. Thank you. All right, we all have the same priorities here now. We get to this marine exhibit and find the phone. We get another chopper in the air to lift us out from there. How are we gonna get there? Trodon could still be out there. We aren't equipped to treat any more bites. We have to- Shh. I will not be shushed. The door. Oh no. They're coming through the vent! Going past the door. <laughs> Jerry, get that grate open. I'm on it. I need something to break the lock. We'll find that something. The air tank. What? Use the air tank! It's heavy and sturdy!
Heads up! must be 40 feet underground. I have no idea where we are. Well, we can't just sit around with our thumbs up our butts. I, I don't hear them anymore. Their behavior seemed territorial. Maybe we're far enough away from the nest that they gave up on us. We might have outpaced them, but we're not exactly in a secure location. Which way are we heading, Doc? Um, look over here. Can you read these? Maybe. If I can find... Yes, yes, okay. We're at a four-way intersection. There are only four such intersections on the plan. Let me just cross-reference these detail labels. Okay, we just have to figure out which intersection we're at. Look around the corridors for any distinguishing features. I'll see if I can eliminate possibilities. Maybe I can help with the plans. They look pretty simple. There's a big yellow pipe going down the left wall. It crosses over the ceiling partway down the corridor. There's a ladder on the right, and on the far wall at the end. I see some sort of water tanks at the end of the hall. There's a big yellow pipe that goes down a bit on the left and then crosses over to the other side. There are these two big electrical boxes of some kind on the right. I see two ladders along the left of the tunnel. There's a big yellow pipe that goes down the left wall and into the floor. There's a set of water tanks partway down the corridor on the right. I see one ladder at the end of the hallway.
I'm just gonna cross this one off. Okay, I hope you're right. What do you think, Jess? Probably not this one? Yeah, I don't think so. I don't think it's this one. How can you keep them all straight? We could be here. I guess they all kind of look the same. Okay, everyone, I think I've got it. Are you sure? I'm positive. We must be here. It's the only one that completely matches our surroundings. Okay, here we are. The desalination plant is here. We're not that far. No, we follow this route here. We follow any water mains at junctions in the direction of convergence. Even still, there's barely any turns. Look, just memorize this route. 